Have you ever noticed that life purpose isn't a destination? The biggest problem that I notice in people that want, you know, to find their purpose is that they think purpose is a place that you arrive at. Like, once you get that business that's really deeply fulfilling, you know, once you form your nonprofit and you're affecting a thousand people's lives, we think that it's this thing that we arrive at. The reason that we seek purpose, right, is because we're sick of the same old mundane of like accumulating things, right, of just like, I'm gonna hit the next milestone in my paycheck, I'm gonna do the next big thing, get the next big award, yet, we apply that same exact mindset to trying to find our purpose, right? When you want, when you're chasing after the American dream and all the success, you want something which will anoint you as worthy. Yet we do the exact same thing when we're trying to find our purpose because we think we haven't found it yet. So we need to go out and do things in order to get it so then we can find our life purpose. Like it's this specific title, yet we, we move away from the American dream because we realize titles aren't important, yet we wait until we find our purpose, our title, so that we can be on purpose. Your life purpose isn't a destination. Life purpose is here right now, right? Have you ever been having a bad day? You were at your job, it just didn't feel like a good day. You were at the grocery store, it didn't feel like a good day. You were walking on the street, you were walking in the hallway at your home. You were doing something and you were not having a good day, right? And then you made someone smile. Or you complimented someone and it changed their day, or you listened to someone that was having a hard day and you stopped and you listened to them. You just did something for someone, right? Whatever it is. And it changed their day. And you just went from not feeling that good to feeling freaking amazing because you just changed someone's day, right? That is purpose. The ability to use your life, the ability to use what you have right now in order to make a contribution. The contribution doesn't come when you create the nonprofit. Mother Teresa wasn't on purpose when the world recognized her as famous. Mother Teresa had been doing work in Calcutta and in the slums for a long time before she was ever notarized, before she ever had a, a, a center in order to take people to help them, before she ever had a nonprofit. Gandhi was on purpose well before the world knew of him. Martin Luther King was on purpose well before he led a march of millions of people. Purpose is here now. If you look under an electron microscope and you look at this reality and you break it down, if a scientist breaks it down, this reality is just a bunch of light photons. Weird to think, right? It's just a bunch of light photons. And you know, we wanna be on purpose because we wanna be a light to the world. The truth is, if you're light photons, you already are a light. The problem is, we wait to shine that light until we build the nonprofit, build the online business, get certified in yoga, learn how to meditate, touch a million people's lives. I'm gonna touch a thousand, I'm gonna change the world. Right now, you can change someone's world. You already are light. You don't need to quit your job. You don't need to make any changes. All you need to do is wake up to right now, the ability that you have right now to be on purpose, to make someone feel loved and appreciated. It doesn't it involve anything except for your intention, except for your time, except to stop waiting until tomorrow because today, man, you could change someone's life. And that's what purpose is right here, right now. Purpose isn't a destination. It's available here, if you'll use it.